Many stories have been told about America's dark past, of a nation founded on the unshakable premise of racism. Stories of violence, hatred, and injustice, of dominance, enslavement, and marginalization. Stories ending in bitterness and complete segregation. Our history haunts us to this day, giving us the pervasive belief that racial conflict and inequality will forever be a part of the American landscape. But did you know there were integrated communities in the American South as early as the 1600s? That Quakers abolished slavery before the American Revolution? And that America's oldest civil rights organizations, like the NAACP and National Urban League, were founded as multiracial coalitions. This is the other tradition of American race relations, a history that has yet to be examined, a tradition that grew up alongside the convention of racism, a tradition built on close cross-racial collaboration, camaraderie, friendship, and mutual loving respect. This racial amity was forged by Americans who held onto the vision of E Pluribus Unum, out of many, one. The other tradition is something um, where people from different racial ethnic groups have worked together to address social injustices throughout history. We know about the tradition of racism and it's important that we study the tradition of racism, but at the same time we need to understand that there's a parallel tradition. In fact, they're interrelated. There have been people all over the country, all through history, who have been able to envision a different kind of, of society. The more obvious the crisis, the more cooperation you see among the races. An American story traces the history of cross-cultural collaboration from the birth of the nation to the present day. Join us in uncovering tales from America's earliest integrated communities, like the hardscrabble frontier town of Covert, Michigan. As early as the 1850s, the citizens of Covert ignored social norms, fugitive slave laws, and mandated segregation. Instead, they quietly created a community where blacks and whites shared everything, from a one-room schoolhouse to public office. Discover the friendships that reached across the color line and led to significant change during America's darkest hours. Like the business partnership between wealthy iron worker Thomas Garrett and ex-slave Harriet Tubman. Learn about the woman Eleanor Roosevelt considered her closest friend and what led the first lady to break Alabama law so the two could sit together at the dinner table. Hear about the shared spiritual calling that led a rabbi to march alongside Dr. Martin Luther King. And see how a partnership between Cesar Chavez and Fred Ross gave rise to a powerful movement for the rights of migrant farm workers. An American story honors the tillers of the soil and caretakers of the tradition of cross-cultural cooperation and amity. Enjoy expert commentary from Professor Cornell West, radio personality Celeste Headley, and other premier scholars in the field of positive race relations. An American Story offers a new lens through which we can all take a fresh look at our collective identity and reframe our vision of the future towards a revival of the dream of E Pluribus Unum out of many, one.